You work for your business at the end of the day. I don't care how much of a boss you are. So what I mean is that if your business is telling you to grow, you're looking at all the stuff online, you're looking at all the stuff in the news, you're looking at the world news, you're like, oh my God, I'm going to hold back, hold back, hold back. The opportunities that you can lose by not listening to your business are massive. And you have to take that into consideration, whether it be getting more equipment, hiring more people, or let's go backwards, maybe slowing down. Maybe, hey, I haven't used this equipment in a while. Maybe it's time for me to sell it. I can pick up 10, 20 grand. Right. That'll help me get, get more prepared. Hey, at home, uh, maybe I can't take home what I was taking home. Oh, I was taking home five grand a month, 10, 20, 50, whatever it was. And maybe now the toys is something that you can get rid of today and understanding the whole process, right? You have to understand the process and listen to your business because your business is going to tell you what to do, whether it's to go harder, pull back, advertise more, don't advertise more. You listen to your business and she'll tell you what you need to do. That's how real winners win.